おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。おはよう。Not down, yeah. but, but it's, it's still nice. It's got like a traditional looking building which is great for souvenirs, so I'll show you some of that as well. You can go there. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's go. Woo! Up the hill, up the hill, up the, up the, up the hill. It's super steep. It's not snowing this time, so it's safe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this man is jogging up the hill. He's really steep, guys. That is impressive. Props to him. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty damn steep. He is fit. These are the cutest little barrier things ever. Only in Japan would they turn them into people. This sign here says you need to get off your bike and start walking. If you made it this far on your bike, like. That's impressive, keep going mate. Cause like oh. I don't think you can tell how steep it is on the camera. If you've made it this far on your bicycle, then that's impressive. Probably would have been easier to push it. Yeah. <laughs> is this the uh, last gate I think? Yeah. yeah. Whoa. Whoa. You can see why they built the castle up here because you'd be pretty dang pooped if you were trying to take this over yeah. back in the day. And the route that we took is the modern route that is like direct up here. It yep. used to be like a zigzag. All the way through the forest. Yeah, so if you were a soldier it would have been really difficult to get here. Especially since it would have been road it would have just been mud. Yep. So. I'm glad I'm not them. Yeah. Let's go exploring! <laughs> Have a little look. How many steps can I go up? Oh. Sounds like they're quite long. Longer than normal steps. Yeah. I'm hoping to get to this one, but not quite. Not quite. <laughs> I prefer to get to the top of that one. <laughs> Yeah, totally. <laughs> and this is the castle! Oh, what's left of it? Yeah, most of the castle is now gone. I think that's a gift shop yeah. over there. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I think this nice building over here, you can see later on, and yeah, everything's pretty much been knocked down. Either it was taken down by, wait, what was it? Restorationist forces. Yeah. In the Meiji period. Yeah, they kind of destroyed it, and then obviously 311 kind of took down whatever else was left. Yeah. So, Sendai Castle is sadly no, no more. Longer standing. But it's still pretty nice up here. And it's a really good viewpoint place. Yeah. And it's got a lot of history, like billboards and stuff. So you can read up. It's nice. Yeah. Show you the view. Yeah, this is kind of what's left of. It's kind of pathetic. <laughs> this is, this is the remains of the castle. Some rocks. Yep, yeah, and, and some more rocks. Pretty fun then. Yeah. This is why we came up here. Look at all the stuff you can see. This is Sendai. Okay, so we're gonna go film a video for the UMST and then we'll show you guys some, some more bits. Yeah, we will. We'll yeah. show you inside the shop as well. It's pretty nice now. Mm. Although I have no money. Okay. The bank is closed. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's film my tripod. Tripod. I brought the big guns out to film today. Yeah. We're done. <gasps> Did the video. That video took such a long time to film because the sun has decided to be a pain Just, in the ass yeah, today. Yeah, it's gone away now. The sun has gone away now, but it's been super sunny and shining in our faces the entire time. So. I'm probably really squinty, but 
<sighs> and also, the woman you can hear in the background, like, uh, yeah. She's just like a recording and she keeps going off and just right the being really it's like loud. The sun goes away and then she starts talking. <sighs> So it took a long time to do, but hopefully we did it good. Hopefully Sheffield will appreciate that. And yeah, now we can get around to just having a bit of a look around. Show you some stuff. Yeah. Go back to regular scheduled programming. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. You can see the city a bit more clearly now. Yeah, slightly different uh, perspective from here. Yeah. So if you can see, but Statues even got the horse's butthole in yeah, it. Even with the bum hole. That, that is impressive sculpturing there. So yeah, here we have the statue of Date Masamune. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He was like the feudal lord in uh, I guess among the more Azuchi Momoyama to like Edo periods of Sendai. It's kind of an interesting history. I could go into it. Shall I go into it? Kind of if you wanna. Well, brief history. Brief history of Date Masamune. He uh, did his first battle when he was 14, he's kind of young, because his dad got captured by the neighbouring prefecture's feudal lord and then tried to kill him. But he actually lost the battle and then he was retreated to his own land. But then the other guy had to retreat because he was being attacked from the other two neighbouring prefectures. And then he was able to live and then from that moment he changed how he does battle and then he became a really good strategist. And then later on, he was kind of like, didn't have very good relationships with like the feudal lords of like Tokyo in that area where they had most of the power. And he almost got done for treason, but then he did the battle of Sekigahara, which is pretty much the battle that unified Japan. And then, yeah, he got his land back and then from that point in 1601, he decided to build this castle. And that's pretty much Date Masamune. Yeah. It was really important. He actually allowed uh, Tokugawa Ieyasu to win at Sekigahara. Also, he has a crescent moon on his helmet because all Japanese peeps like to have something crazy on their heads. Yeah. So as you can see there, really, really big. I don't really know how that's like helpful yeah. in battle. I don't know if it was did that he actually, big. Did he actually wear that when he fought? Because, I mean, looking at, that's quite big. I mean, maybe maybe mm. it'd be good for like stabbing people. <laughs> <laughs> just like maybe. wiggle your head. Just I don't like, know. Err. Maybe it was smaller in actual battle. Maybe that's just for like ceremony purposes. Maybe. But Maybe yeah. it'd be good for fighting with. Just yeah. like you could carry people either so, side. Yeah. Because yeah, he was rewarded a gun. He was like one of the first people to actually use a gun Ooh. and get good with it. So. Fancy. Yeah, but he obviously still used his samurai katana. So you know, he was pretty awesome. Kyle likes him. And he did really good for the people because he actually um, was really good for the infrastructure and he made a lot of uh, people's hunger go away. So, yeah. Pretty dang Ihito. He was, he was. Yeah. He did a lot. We found a shrine. Yeah. I think. It's quite elaborate, isn't it? Very red and colourful, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty swish. Pretty fancy. See, you can hear the woman. This is where she's coming from. <laughs> I hate this woman. Ooh, we're inside the shop now. Look, these are Tanabata decorations. Because Tanabata in Sendai is like really famous. See, all these are cranes. That's a lot of cranes. They remember making cranes for Japan Day, but this is like ridiculous. Is that a penis? What is that? <laughs> Small children, look away. I'm censoring it. I'm confused. Oh, well, that was fun. We bought some postcards to send to some potential Ichinense. So yeah. if you have found us through this, then hello to you. We hope to see you in September. That'll be fun. Um, but yeah, so we did that and then we bumped into some people and they took a picture with us. Ta da! Yeah. Yeah, like, they're supposedly like people who were with Date Masamune and yeah. like castle -y peeps. I forgot to mention, uh, Date Masamune wears black armour because it was really cool in the time. Or shadow, it was cool. <laughs> and it made him stand out on the battlefield, so yeah, there you go. So like if you see, 
because he's wearing black armor. And the yellow bits are just for highlights, just to make him look even more cool, badass. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Kyle is totally standard. Oh, yeah. Oh, from the head behind it. ダタマサムネ様になった。ああ。いや、スピードレディーナ。ノーノー、ヒーザレディー。オーマイガッシ。メイクレディーフェイス。ミックレディーフェイス。いや。オーマイガッシ。いや。オーマイガッシ。いや